Hey, it is Chip back here with a rapid review. The kids are asleep, or at least pretending to, so I thought I would talk about really quickly the new Miles Everyday short. Is it really improved? We got this email and it said, hey, the best damn short just got better than ever. And we thought we'd test it out. So here we are in the middle. This is the new and improved one. The one on the right is a long version of their old version. And the one on the left is the Oliver's all over short. Uh, they're frequently compared to each other. We've done comparisons next, next to each other. Before I go any further, I know you're looking at these and probably thinking, man, these are super wrinkled. And they do come out of the wash a little bit wrinkled, but you put them on, wear them out for you know five minutes, and they don't look wrinkled anymore. So don't worry about that before we go any further. Uh, one of the most interesting things about them is, is the material. The, they look very, very similar. The Oliver short on the left there is a little bit quieter. I did a whole video about how quiet the Oliver shorts are versus the Miles shorts. Um, and the new upgraded Miles shorts are actually a little bit quieter. Um, they've tweaked the content of the fabric just a little bit. You can see the original Miles shorts are 87% nylon, 13% spandex. The new ones are 88% nylon and 12% spandex. And the Oliver's ones are 87% nylon 13% spandex. The brand new Miles shorts also have this back pocket, which is awesome. I used to hate not being able to have a place to put my, my wallet in my back pocket, which is where it usually goes. And these ones now have a back pocket, which is awesome. If it's a wallet perfectly, that way you can put your cell phone, your keys in the front pockets. It's a great addition. The Miles short also has some updated coloring on it. This is what they call coal. And you can see it's not exactly black. The Oliver short on the left is their black but this short is a little bit more blue. It's also got some nice blue uh, touches, turquoise touches on the sides of the pockets. The Oliver's has a little bit less branding being the coloring, which I tend to prefer a little bit, but I also really like the new Miles short there. It's a great short. It's definitely gonna be added to my rotation. I really like to wear these shorts out in the summer when I'm being active, you know, going around town. Um, they're, they're just a great addition to anyone's wardrobe. If you need some athletic looking shorts that are not just like the regular athletic looking shorts, like you, you see at Walmart, like these I have in my hand here. Now here's an older pair of the Oliver shorts. Any shorts that have a combination of spandex and nylon will have some of this, uh, pilling that happens on the, especially in the crotch area. I don't know why it's the crotch area, but you use one of those little, uh, D D pillars that you get on Amazon for you know 10, 15 bucks and that comes right off. But any nylon short will will have this that happens on it. Quickly here are the different lengths. The miles short comes in six, eight, and ten inch inseam. That is a eight inch inseam. The Oliver short is seven and a half inch inseam, it's about exactly the same. And below that you'll see the original miles everyday short. Uh, it's a regular length there and the long length underneath. I wouldn't recommend the long length. I think that was actually a little bit over 10 inches if I if I remember correctly, but don't get those. Get the regular or the shorts, depending upon what you what kind of style that you like. Okay, so I got criticized last time for only talking about the sound of these pairs of shorts here. So real quickly, here are the new mile shorts. Here are the old mile shorts. And here are the Oliver's all over short. And then here are some cheap champion shorts that you'd get at Target or Walmart. So you can see the new Miles shorts have improved quite a bit. The loudest is still the old Miles shorts. The next loudest is probably the new Miles shorts, then the Olivers, and then just the crappy ones that you can get at, at Walmart or, or Target. Uh, I even wear cotton shorts around the house just some cheap like $5 ones you can get on Amazon if I'm just hanging out or if I'm going to sleep because they're not loud at all. So they've improved the loudness of it quite a bit. They've also added some waterproof protection. Haven't had a chance to try that out yet since it's been winter here in Colorado, but I hope you got some new information. I hope you check them out. They're a great product. I really like Miles. I really like a lot of things that they do. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comment section below. Thanks.